Good afternoon and a very warm welcome to a blustery but importantly dry day here at the Lillishaw National Sports Centre for this under-13 Inter-Association Cup for boys final. Gateshead Schools versus Croydon Schools, a fantastic match in prospect. Players are out there warming up whilst they're doing that. Let's take a quick look at the two teams. First up, it's the Gateshead Schools in goal. Preston Leach, number two, Lucas Cully, Daniel Parker, Ryan Doherty, Jack Whitaker, Luke Craggs, Sean Neves, Anthony Munda, Jeevan Samal, Noah Cunningham and Cameron Nonis. Coached by Adam Jones. Plenty of goals in this team. Goals have been shared about throughout this competition. Ryan Doherty with four. Jeevan Samal with four as well, as is Cameron Nonis. And Sean Neve has three goals, so plenty of goals in this team. I was trying to follow as much social distancing as possible. And the, the first corner, I knew straight away, they're all cuddling, I thought. We're in, we're in trouble oh, here. We're the Croydon team. The wall, they want us to come stand got by you. Ramos Angua in goal. If you've got Zach Ija. That's Nick Antano, Genesis Antwi, Leon Elliott, Jeffrey Okoro, Elijah Gordon Douglas, Enrique Lameras, Moses Pizatu, Rizgar Badir, and Caleb Redhead, coached by Richard Wilder. Plenty of goals in this team as well, but most of them coming through Moses Pizatu. The number nine with nine goals so far in this competition. 17 in all competitions this season. That's just from eight games played. It's fantastic strike rate. And three goals for Rizgar Badir. Have a look at the substitutes and four gates head. Ethan Walker, Owen Clark and Elliot Wilson. Unfortunately, Ollie Harrison and Luke Hood are unable to make today's squad due to COVID okay. reasons. Unfortunate for them. For Croydon Schools, it's Philip Hayford, Ben Mills, Oscar Moore, Subby Noiki, and Nick Lee. I've done one of each. The social distance one for Phil, the chairman. They're all saying, why do social distance not the our match officials for today's game, Nathan Bartram, he's our referee, assisted by Andy Smith and Matt Newbold. Mark Warren is the fourth official. 
And I am Simon Webb and I'll be your commentator for today's game and it's a game I'm very much looking forward to. Plenty of goals as I've already said between these two teams in the competition. Just give me some. Gateshead scored 25 goals so far in their five games played. Five goals a game, great record. And for Croydon, 22 goals scored so far. Croydon do have the better defensive record, though. Two clean sheets, only five goals conceded. Ten goals conceded for Gateshead in their five games. Gateshead are former champions having won this competition in 2009, 11 years ago. Last year they made it through to the last 32. This is the first time in the final for Croydon. In fact, it's the first time any Croydon district team at any age group has made it through to the final for over 40 years. So fantastic achievement for the boys from Croydon. It is a compulsory law. Well, we are just a minute or two away it's from kickoff. If I were somewhere, I would be the one to tell someone. I'm sure we're all happy to see that it's stayed dry here at Lily Shaw. Plenty of rain around the country. It is blustery out there. Just the line in front of the camera. Are you going to do um, question that's worth asking me? Are you going to do your uh, knee at the kickoff? <laughs> oh boy. Lads, just send you a skipper across quick, just borrow your set. Yeah, if they want to, yeah, that's fine, yeah, if they want to line up, get everyone in. We'll do the toss here, and then we can go out and then we can crack on, yeah? Just here, the referee, just getting the two captains to come in for the toss, doing it on the sidelines as the players are ready, lined up, ready to come onto the pitch for today's cup final. It is Gateshead that have won the toss and pick their ends. Gateshead will be in the yellow and blue. Croydon will be in the blue and black. Okay, guys, all set. We'll walk out. Hi, boys. And here they come. Oh, officials oh, followed oh, by oh, the teams. Very proud moment for all these players. Worked hard all season long to get here. Guys, that's a really nice touch. <laughs> I'm feeling awful now. Send her at the post. We'll put you in the post. Yeah, do that. I'll give you the end yeah, of the yeah. will be Croydon to get the match underway. All the formalities are out of the way. It's going to be 35 minutes each way. From the start! Come on, Croydon! Best game in the back for a while, yeah? Come on. Boys, come on. Come on, Luke. Come on. Nathan, take you there for it. Luke, let's start Good work from Daniel Parker. Oh, 
early chance there for Kuzatu. Been prolific so far in this competition. Well, the opportunity to test his range. Easy for the keeper on this occasion. Redhead loses out. Loose pass from Whitaker. And now it goes for a throw in on the far side. Sean, Sean, you need to drop it there for this. Good turn and ball. Cross comes in. Oh, well defended. Anthony Munder gets the block in, sends it out for a corner. It was a good run down the right. So it'll be Gordon Douglas with the corner. Good strong defensive header. Go on, Go on, Good lad. Send him. Lucas, well done. Do it, Lucas. Do it. Left hand side just loses out. Go on, battling there. Vegito with the long ball. No one there. All the way through to the keeper, Preston Leach. Good play at the back from the skipper, Leon Elliott. Pretty good play there. Three Gates have players stripping the ball. But Sean Need loses out and gives away the foul. Hold back a bit. Is that, oh, nearly an opportunity, that was Badir. Just couldn't get on that long ball from the keeper. Oh, great play from Sean Neve. Beats one. Tries to put some out through. Croydon just struggling to clear their half at the moment. Ball comes across. Good save. Chance. Brilliant goal from Samal. It was a good initial save, but the ball came back in. Take another look at the goal. Initially blocked from the keeper, but good composure to find out his man, and Samal puts it into the open net. Go on, 
Gina, come on! So Gates had take the early lead. Just over five minutes played, one nil ahead. Good work. Come on, Ryan! Have a move! Well cleared up from Crags. Referee's pulled it back for a foul. Oh, ball's all the way through. Great save. Sean Neve with the opportunity. But straight at the keeper and a brilliant save from Angua. Well done, Luke. Push up. Push up. Luke, Luke. Sean, stop. Come on. Crawled in with the throw in. Initially loose control from Doherty, but recovered. Go on, go on, Lucas, go on, Lucas. This is Bazatu in the star player for Croydon this year. Early touch of the ball for him. Now we've got the goal scorer somehow. Oh, very close. Came off the, the Croydon man. Didn't know a huge amount about it. Boys, you know how big his kick is. Daniel Porter, well done. Zatu trying to get on the end well, of that long it. ball, no uh, well defended. Whitaker. Send him! Good anticipation from the keeper, very close to the edge of his box. Boys, watch his kick, Ryan, Jack. Gu has done well. We know how big it is. Massive kick from the keeper and not dealt with, and it's in. Referees. Well, no, the goal has been given. Boys, you need a command at the back, man. Come on. We'll take a look at this again. Long ball from the keeper all the way through. Two defenders there, neither could deal with it. And it's the number 10, Rizgar Badir, that's slots at home to tie the scores up. Oh, good work from Jack Whittaker. Referee's called for a foul on the edge of the box. Good opportunity here for Gateshead. Yeah. 
Hey, just one spare! All the way through to the keeper. Decent strike, but easy for the keeper. Looking to launch it long once again. The ball nearly lands at Satu's feet. Couldn't control it on this occasion. Oh. Redhead. Looking for Pizzatu. Strong defending. Eventually fouled from Pizzatu. Corden come again with Badir, the goal scorer, shoots from range. Keepers there. Not quite the power to beat the keeper from that distance. Zatu. Santui. Loses out. Way offside. Keeper's very quick off his line. It's two or three occasions he's done that. Ball's gone out for a throw in. Just gained a few yards. Another Croydon throw in. Looking to release some out. He can't get on it. This time, the keeper plays it short. Lomeras loses out. Long ball looking for Redhead. It goes out of play. Plenty of pressure being put on the back line of Gateshead by Croydon, but they've dealt with it well. Now they come forward with some out. And Parker's just brought down. Referee's given the throw in rather than the foul. Good turn and snap shot. The keeper deals with that one. Push up. Really good work from Doherty. Falls at the feet of Cunningham. Neve. Just couldn't pick out his man. Redhead. Use him. Finds Mazatu. Good strength to get into the box. Gets his shot away, but just dragged it wide. 
Enrique, Enrique. Elijah, Elijah. Andres! Enrique. Nick, push over a bit. Good turn from Nonas. Brilliant run from Doherty. Gets his shot away, well blocked. Another effort from distance, this time high and wide. Doherty looking for some out. Good work in defence. So Cully with the throw in. Back to Cully who gets the cross in. Plenty of yellow shirts there. Referee calls for a foul. Good work from Badir. Great control. Again, looking to go over the top, trying to pick out Pizzatu, the danger man for Croydon. Even, stop with Sean, Sean, go through the middle. Even, come on the right side for us, mate. One of the gates have players. Sean, last man, every That's side. Lucas Cully just down, needing a little bit of treatment. Quickly onto his feet, it's good to see, he's going to be fine. So it will be a throw in for Croydon and Sanu. Goes for the long throw into the box, Bizatu. Just tries to dink it over the keeper, but just too much on it. Puts it over the crossbar as well. Three in there. You, Ryan, and Jack. Three in the centre. Okay, Ted happy to play it short from the back. Even Helmo, even Helmo. From Doherty. Brilliant work from Neve. Just couldn't get a chance. Retains possession. Doherty into the box. Strong from the keeper, punches it. Foul's been given. Ryan, Ryan, drop. Ryan, you drop another five. 20 minutes gone in the first half. Still 1 1. Good boy, Ryan. Well done, with the first goal through. Some out. Equaliser coming from Badir. Well done, Ryan. Croydon. Ryan, make sure you get Noah in next to your lead. Let's take him to the next one, yeah? Yes, Go on, Enrique. Go, Tim. Taylor behind you. It's your man. Come on. 
Good play from Badir. Settle things down. Caleb Redhead looking to, to turn and go. Just runs it out of play. Well, Redhead again. Redhead driving into the box. Not dealt with. Oh, just Lucas! wide. Lucas! Nine! The referee has given the corner. Must have been a touch from one of the Gateshead players. Great run from Redhead. Boys, come on, first and second. That will be Gordon Douglas to swing this in. Left footed. Goes for the near post. Goes straight out. Bit of a waste. Okay, so defenders being put under pressure high up the pitch. Couldn't keep it in. We'll go out for a throw. Go on, Ryan. Follow him, man. Follow him, man. Follow him, man. Get in there. Asano looking for Bizatu. Can't be dealt with by the Croydon defence. And to eat. It was fouled. It will be Lamaris with the free kick. Was looking front. Uh, for Kazatu, sorry. But not on this occasion. Well dealt with by the Gateshead defenders. Ryan Munda, well done. Okay, back in your strength. Defense in strength. Hey, look, the lines are dropping. Lucas, go down the line. Ryan, get in front of him. Go line. More coffee than midfield, boys. Stay with your man. Jack, 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 but out it goes. Good turn for Antwi. Brilliant work from Lamares. Still Lamares. Yes, well done, well done, Lucas. Good lad. Stop playing it on the stack. Yeah, watch him, he's rolling under. Let's get up, let's get on the pitch, Leo. Push him off. Even going in, follow him in, follow him in, follow him in. Ryan, turn the face, come on, pick him on. Get him on. Show and stay high, show and stay high. Go on, Jeevan! Ansano into the box. And again and again. Well done, boys. Well done. Lucas, take your time. Go line. Jeevan, need you in here. Jeevan, need you in here. Jeb, Jeb. Brilliant work from Doherty. Great turn. Long ball. Didn't reach his simple, simple, more simple, please. 
Gateshead have got a throw in deep into the Croydon half of the pitch. Lucas Cully coming up to take it. Cully gets the ball in. Push up! Push up! Come on, bro! Great work from Munda. Beats one, beats two. Eventually fouled. Really strong play from Anthony Munda. Stay with your runners! Whitaker with a long strike for, for goal. It's well high and wide. looking to go long again. Who hasn't gone out. Good work from Samal. Very strong play. Still Samal. Defender stayed with him. Really good play. Rizatu. Rizatu wants the penalty but not given. Lamaris from distance. Easy for the keeper. Cracks did well. Slow it down. Well, the ball has gone out. All the way back to the Croydon captain, Leon Elliott. Brilliant work from Antwi, looking to get Pisatu free in the middle, just too strong. Through to the keeper. Doxy wins the throw in. Nick, hey, won the free kick. It looks like it's going to be Ryan Doherty to take. Swing it in with his left foot. Great ball into the middle. 
get rid. Let's go. A couple of good Counts defensive on. headers. Counts on. Let's go. He comes going, out to red, red head. He's got options. He's gone from distance, didn't strike it as cleanly as he wanted. All stays in though with the Maris. Linesman has blown for. I think he's blown for a foul. Into the last five minutes of this first half. Still all square at one all. A deep ball into the box. No one there to meet it though. Goes all the way out of play. Dangerous ball. With Luke Cully. Manon, Manon. Goes back to his skipper. Ivan, go, Ivan, go. Somehow trying to get on the end of it. Wouldn't drop for him. Comes to Redhead. Looking for Pizzatu. Ball to run on to. Obviously cleaned up. Manon, Manon, Manon! Oh, somehow looking to go down the right, just over hits it, out of play. Doherty from range, just too high. Good strike, but just over the bar. Doherty has scored four times in this competition. Not on this occasion. He can't play in defence, finds Doherty, has options in front of him. Good ball out to the left. Oh, brilliant defending from Mejita. Best clearance and Kate's head will come again with Samal. Eventually he fouls Daniel Parker. Sorry, excuse me. Nick Monsano. Pisatu. Loses out. Good defensive work. Gateshead. Yellow card awarded to Ryan Doherty. That was for a foul on Antwi. It's going to be the Croydon skipper. We get the game underway again. Leon Elliott. Good 
to try and get something into the box. Looking for Pizzatu. Really solid play from Ajita. Quick one, two. And it's still with Ajita. And this time just loses out. It will be a goal kick. But I think the referee has blown for half time. Excellent half of football, very evenly contested. It is Gateshead Schools 1, Croydon Schools 1. Just have a quick look at the goals. It was Gateshead who scored first, calmly put away by Jeevan Samal. But Croydon responded quickly. A long ball not dealt with by, Gate, uh, by Gateshead. And Badir was able to come through, pop it into the net. So we are all square at half time. We will pick up the action in a few minutes for the second half.
So the players are back out for the second half. It is Croydon scores one, Gateshead scores one. Gateshead with the first score inside the first five minutes. Even some out. Quick response from Croydon on the ninth minute. Rizgar Badir to level the scores up. So halfway through this cup final, we're no nearer to finding out who will walk away with the trophy. His gate set in the yellow and blue. And Croydon in the blue and black. Looks like Croydon have made a change. Ben Mills has come on. Not quite sure who's come off at this stage, but you know when we find out. It's good work down the left from Caleb Redhead. Just runs into trouble. Pizzatu. Oh, Pizzatu scores. Ball came through to the prolific striker and he made no mistake. Had very few opportunities in front of goal. Slots this one home nicely enough. In fact, it was a brilliant ball through. Really good run. Just dinks it over the keeper. He got a touch on it, but wasn't able to keep it out of the net. And Croydon take a lead very early in the second half. And it is Moses Pesatu with the goal. That's his 10th goal in this competition. His 18th goal in all competitions, and this is just his ninth game. Incredible record for the young man. And Croydon find themselves in front for the first time. 2-1. Uh, that was the substitute that was brought down by Mills with his first touch of the game. Ben, good start. Nick, good start. Uh, boy, Keeper comes forward to take the long ball into the box. Looked like Neve was going to have an opportunity on the edge of the box, just stumbled. The opportunity came and went. Brilliant turn from Mills. Cross didn't match the turn. Another good turn from Mills. Better cross this time, chance. Good goalkeeping. Nunes. Somehow. Oh, somehow tried from distance, didn't get any power on the strike. Easy for the keeper. Tuck in, tuck in, tuck in. Here we go, here we go, 
This is Redhead trying to cross it. All the way across the box, no one there to meet it. Good run from Redhead though. And Twee loses out. Really good play from Whittaker. Oh, great ball from Nunes through to Neve. Who puts. Oh, yeah, it's gone in. It's a goal. Brilliant work from Gateshead. Just a brilliant ball through from Nunes. Keeping. Brilliant work down the right. Defended well in the end. Ball through from Nunes, through to Neve. Going away from goal. Just dinks it over the keeper into the far corner. Brilliant stuff from Neve. Excellent goal, and we are all square. 2-2. Two, two. Put it in, put it in, put it in. us again. Now with Doherty. Bounces around back to Nonis. Good work from Nonis. Gets the cross in. It's easy for the keeper. Ball calls for a foul from Pusatu. Ball from Antwi to Mills. Back to Mills. That's good defending. Up to Samal. Tries to turn. Yes, they are going. 
Brilliant ball from Elliot. Trying to find Mills. Calmly cut out from Crags. Oh, good little dink around the corner from Samal. Looking to release Whitaker. Ref can have a shot. Noah. Lucas, go see him. Ryan. Ryan. Switch him. Jack, go right side. Ryan, go there. Croydon will have the throw in. Looking for Pizzatu. Well defended from Munda, but all he can do is get it out for another throw in. This time it's Badir. With some out. Ball over the top from Samal. No power on the strike. Easy for Angua. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Ministry of National Sports Centre today for the film of the Industry of Ryan, come on, Ryan, open your body. Luke, open your body. Get on, son. You carry that. But dear, keeper gets there first. Keeper's come a long way. He has to backtrack, wait for the ball to get into the box before he can pick it up. Somehow trying to get on it. He has got on it. Finds. Nonis. Loose ball from Nonis. Badir. Looking to find Pasatu, but does, doesn't quite get the ball right. This is Cully. Mills out on the right. Bizatu. Oh, great. great block. Hey, hey. Oh, I'm lucky. Zach, Zach, get back now. Good shot. Samal trying to release his teammate. Run! This is Antwi to Mills. Better, much better. Good defending from Nunes, but it goes out for a corner. Looks like there's been another substitution as well. Nick Lee has come on for Croydon. Winner. Redhead coming along to coming across to take the corner. Swing it in, right footed. 
was looking for Pisatu, just too strong. And Wunder was able to clear. Whitaker trying to turn it around the corner. Finds some out. Doherty from range, trying to get it into the box. No one in there to meet it. Come on, we're losing now. Badir. Still Badir. It's fallen to Basatu. Out to Redhead. Just trying to find it back through to Basatu, but couldn't find the ball. Still with Croydon, though. Go, Ryan. Go, Ryan. Go, Ryan. Go, Ryan. Go, Ryan. Go, Ryan. Great work from Doherty. Brilliant defensive play from Doherty. With Mills. This time he's fouled. It's going to be Sack Ajita to take the free kick. Good ball, Zach. Whip it into the penalty spot. The ball into the box. Skipper Elliott was trying to get ahead on it, couldn't. To come back out to Ajita. Lovely little ball. So one tweet. Jeff, get back. Jeff, get back. Long ball looking to release some out. Referee pulls it back. Given offside has been given on some out. Come on, big push. Come on. Oh, more good work from Doherty. Oh, just slips as he was trying to pass the ball away, but the referee has called it a foul. Right, over here, over here. Come on, come on, Ball goes out of play off Mills. It's head with the throw in. Next one, next one, go. Go on. Even steal from, even steal from. And Tweed trying to release his teammate. Cut out. 
by the gates head defence. Right from Mills. Press, 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 press. It's gone all the way back to the Croydon captain. He finds Ansano in space, knocks it forward for Redhead. Go on, Ryan, go on, Ryan, go on, Ryan. Pisatu in the box. Just couldn't control his first touch. Get in the box, Mo. Out to Mills. Back to Pisatu. Foul goes against him. Hey, face up, who's marking? Who's marking? If that goal kick has been given into the last 20 minutes, last 15 minutes of the match, 2-2 in this cup final. Both teams have been in front. Gates said first, then Croydon. Peg back. Mills. And tweet. Oh, brilliant stuff from Croydon, but the, the shot comes in just high and wide. Ben, well played, Genesis quality. Got kick only as far as Antwi. Gets it through to Samal. Holds it up well. Back to Nonis. Send it, send it in. That's Daniel Parker. And he's fouled by Ben Mills. Gates head with a free kick in a dangerous area. Jack, down there, Jack, keep going, Jack. Where's the water there, Lee? Jack, over here, fast ball, over here. Jack, it's got to be a good delivery, over here, the ball. Go through it. Get it, Jeff, come on, challenge for it. Drop, drop, Jack, drop, Jack. Try! Nonis. No one in the box for him. Easily cleared. Redhead trying to release. Pisatu just slips. Gates had come forward again with the skipper. Doherty. Oh, Doherty looking, looking from range. Didn't quite catch his shot. Dangerous ball into the box, too far for Jack Whittaker. Come, come, dropping the hole for us. 
Go on, Ryan. Go on, Ryan. Good luck, Ryan. Yeah, come across, come across. Come on, Cam. Come on, Cam. Yes, yes, yes. Lucas, on your shoulder. On your shoulder, Lucas. Ryan, you got to drop. You got to drop. Get there, get there. Good luck. Oh, right. Into the final 10 minutes of the match. Still 2 2. Long ball into the box. Point in Elliot! Redhead looking to break. All comes all the way back to the gates, a keeper. Doherty clears, Watch looking for some out. Long ball it. over the top. This is Nonis into Whitaker. Some out. Oh, great diving challenge in the end from Leon Elliott. Looked like Smell was going to have a great opportunity. Nonis. And again, Jack, and again! Whitaker. Good ball out to the left. With Parker. Still Parker. Eventually Mark, running into trouble, deliver, but the ball deliver, comes back deliver. to Gateshead. Whitaker into the box. Finds his man. And Parker just knocks it wide of the post. The Twitter vote for Man of the Match is now live. At Schools Football. Be open for 10 minutes. Two players from each team have been nominated. For Gateshead. It is Ryan Doherty. And Sean Neve for Croydon. It is Moses Bisatu and Rizgar Badir. So your four players go to at schools football and have your vote. Come on, Ryan, you're here for us now. Good play from Antwi. Finds Mills. Oh, well cut out. Dangerous ball from Mills across the box. Cut out by the Gateshead defender. So it'll be Redhead to come across and take this corner. Will there be a final twist in this game or are we going through to penalties? Remember your positions. Make your way and run. Just over seven minutes plus stoppage time to find a winner. A dangerous ball across the puck, not dealt with. Back to Redhead. In the end, Owen Clark, the substitute for Gateshead, did just about enough. That's much better, Croydon! Oh, what a touch from Doherty, keep it in play. Tries to tee up his man. Nonis does get there. It's with the skipper. Mundau. Oh, just wide. 
Munda found himself in the Croydon box. Just pushed his shot wide of the post. What a great opportunity that was for Anthony Munda to get his side back in front. So there's some more changes just going on. Hey, come on, Kiyote, come on! Big lift now! Jeevan, come on! Big come on! Big pressings up there! Yeah, I've got five, just pressing all 60 on penalties. Redhead looking for Pizzatu, finds his man. Mills, good tackle. Still Mills though. Oh, and Tweet loses it. Brilliant work in defence. Oh, Doherty steals it. Tries to lead, release Samal, who's in. And Samal, oh, great challenge. Once again, Leon Elliott diving block. Not for the first time in this match. Another great opportunity for Gates at this time. Fell to the feet of Jeevan Samal. They will have the corner. Last few minutes of this game. A couple of really good opportunities for them to score the winner. Keeper punches it. Only to the edge of the box. Back with Gateshead. Munda scraps for the ball well. Parker loses out. And Munda's back on it again. And Tweet. Really good turn around the corner. Ball comes all the way through. Chance. Good save. This time Doherty loses out. Strong challenge from Hayford. Not long left in this match now. Will there be a winner? No extra time in this final. It will be straight through to penalties. If we don't find a winner in the next two minutes plus stoppage time. Will there be a final twist? Well, the keeper's come a long way. He come, he, oh, it's gone out. Just look for a second, he might lose out, but was able to recover. The ball's gone out of play. It will be a gate's head throw. Some out. Foul throw's been given. Croydon looking to get on with it quickly. Looking for Pisatu. Scored so many goals in this competition. Is there going to be a final twist with him? Not this time. Gates have won it back. Gates have wanted the foul, wasn't given. Doherty. Just loses control this time. Although he has won the foul. Hayford just committing the foul.
This is a slight break in play for an injury. Gateshead will have a free kick in a dangerous area. Ryan Doherty looking to swing it into the box. Not long left on the clock, seeing if they can get one more opportunity to get this goal. We'll give them their first trophy in this competition for 11 years. I think that's Cameron Nonis on the floor. He's up and walking. Slowly making his way off the pitch before he'll be allowed back on. Ball from Doherty. Speculative try from range. Goes high and wide as we go into stoppage time at the end of this match. Well, let's get organised, get sorted, here we go. There you go, there you go. Well, ball's through, Nonis with a chance. Couldn't quite reach it. Now Doherty. Still Doherty. Good defending from Hayford this time. Really strong defending. And this time he is fouled by Doherty. Nonis can't breach it. Monsano does well. Goes for a foul on Doherty. Bissat. Oh, just for a second, looked like Bissatu was going to be through. Keeper's done well, comes out quickly to clear his lines. He scored now and it's hard. Make this count! <laughs> Croydon have already come through this competition with a last minute winner in round two. They scored a last minute goal to beat Brighton and Hove. Have they got another last minute winner here in the final? The redhead to swing it in. All the way across goal. And the foul's been given. Doherty again, Stop. looking Stop. to release Smile up front. Stop. Well blocked out with Croydon man. Deep into stoppage time now. There has been one or two injuries in this match. Can't be long left now. Elliot, just keep him right for 30 seconds. Keep him in there, Hawk! Keep him in there, Hawk! Jeeva, get in there, Jeeva! Make him run in there, go on! Keep him 
Daniel Parker looking to launch one. Throw into the box. Good flick on. Across the goal, but Croydon are able to clear their lines. Well, somehow, Doherty. Doherty. Oh, good strike, but just too high. Hey, come on, get it, Get it up. The referee does blow for full time, so we have finished at 2-2. Two, two. And we will go to penalties to decide who will win this cup final. Just take a quick look at the goals while the teams get themselves sorted for this penalty shootout that will decide who goes through. First goal for Gateshead from Samal in the fifth minute. It was a pretty quick response from Croydon. Long ball over the top all the way through. Not dealt with by the defenders and Badir just able to poke it past the keeper. Into the second half and Croydon were able to take the lead. With Moses Pizzatu, really calm, confident finish. But it was a, another quick response this time from Sean Neve. Probably the goal of the game. Brilliant ball through from Nonus. And there was plenty left for Neve to do. And he just dinks it over the keeper into the far corner. And brilliant goal. And that tied the scores up. And that is why we are through to a penalty shootout. Managers just having their team talks, working out who will be taking these penalties. It said, look like they're ready. Has been a fantastic game, very competitive, very even contest. 2-2 Two is probably a fair result, although a penalty shootout is never a nice way to decide a match, let alone a cup final. Whilst we're waiting for the players to get ready, just announced that the results of the player of the match vote on Twitter, and it is Croydon's Rizgar Badir. That has been voted player of the match.
Richard Wilder just giving his final instructions to his team. And they are ready as well. Two goalkeepers, Ramos and Goa, and Preston Leach for Gateshead. Now those will be a hero for their teams. As the referee just wants to have a quick word with both captains. Croydon that have won the toss. And it will be Gateshead that will take the first penalty. And it will be Jack Whitaker. So Whitaker with the first penalty. Oh, and he misses. Just to the right of the goal. Leon Elliott, the Croydon captain, steps up. He'll take the first penalty. He'll take the responsibility. He has scored a couple of goals in this competition. And he scores again. Excellent penalty. And Croydon with the early advantage. Now it's Cameron Nonnes, who has scored four, co four goals in this competition. Oh, it's, uh, it's in. Good penalty. And Goa went the right way, but not able to have a strong enough hand to keep it out. Now Elijah Gordon Douglas for Croydon. Oh, brilliant save from Preston Leach. And he enjoyed that one. It was a decent penalty. But Preston Leach went the right way. Very strong hand to keep it out. Now Sean Neve, who scored that brilliant goal in the second half to bring the scores to 2-2. Puts his team in front in the shootout. Ben Mills who looked very positive when he came on in the second half. Down the right-hand side for Croydon. Yeah! 
and saved. This time Leach stands his ground. Penalty down the middle and he saves. Giving Gateshead the advantage. Now it's Samal. Four goals in the competition for today. Scored today as well. Five goals. Leading scorer for Gateshead. Oh, and he saved. Brilliant save from Angua. High and to his left-hand side, but very strong. Brilliant save. And that's going to give Enrique Lomeras an opportunity to tie things up after four penalties each. The referee just wants to make sure Paul is on the spot correctly. Oh, brilliant penalty from Lamares. Very calmly slotted into the bottom left-hand corner. No chance for the keeper. So we're 2-2 two -two after four penalties. And it will be the Gateshead captain, Anthony Munda, to take their fifth. And he scores. Come on, Puts them 3-2 ahead. On the verge of their first ever trophy in this competition. But it is going to be the prolific Moses Busatu with the fifth penalty for Croydon. Scored 10 goals in this competition. 18 in all in nine games. Very prolific. And very calmly done from Busatu. And we're going to go to extra penalties. Daniel Parker steps up for Gateshead Schools. And he scores. Now it's the Croydon number three. Nick and Sano to keep the minute. And he scores. Some very good penalties being taken now. Now it's Doherty. Who was very influential in the match for Gateshead. Slots at home, left footed. So Oscar Moore to keep Croydon in it once again. And he beats the outstretched arm of Preston Leach. Keeps Croydon in the competition. As we go to the eighth penalty for Gateshead. It's Elliot Wilson. Which team will blink first? Quite a few scores on the trot for both these teams. And he blinks. 
great save from Angua. That means that Genesis and Twi steps up for Croydon to win the competition. Oh, and he hits the bar. Sent the keeper the wrong way, but then hits the bar. And we are still all square. Now it's Luke Craggs for Gateshead. We'll be happy to still be in this shootout. Yeah. Well struck penalty. And they're back in front. Caleb Redhead steps up to take Croydon's ninth penalty and keep them in this final. Keepers just battling the sun as well. Oh, keeper went the right way, but he doesn't manage to get a hand on it. And we will go to a tenth penalty. Ethan Walker, Gateshead substitute, substitute, sorry. Scored a couple of goals in the competition so far. Scored in the 5-1 win over the Sunderland. And the 4-2 victory over Wirral. And this time, it goes wide. So Croydon, after so many penalties to keep themselves in it, they step up with a chance to win it for the second time. Last time they hit the bar. And it will be the keeper. And Gua, keeper on keeper. And it's saved. Preston Leach goes the right way, keeps his team in this final. Preston, have yourself a minute. Shut down, Preston. Eleventh penalty coming up, and it will be Preston Leach, the Gateshead goalkeeper this time. Dinks it. Keeper went the right way, got a hand to it, but couldn't keep it out. And Gates said, go in front. Come on, Preston! Now, Akoro steps up to keep his team in it. champions Preston Leach the goalkeeper he is the hero as his teams run to him
Great scenes for Gateshead as they win their first trophy. First, comp first time in this competition for 11 years. Commiserations to Croydon. We put up a great fight in their first ever final. And they lose out in the penalty shootout. That is the full-time result. Gateshead scores, FA win in the penalty shootout. All 11 players were used. Brilliant match. Two very even teams, but it is Gateshead that come out on top. We'll re show you the goals as they just set up for the presentation. This was in the fifth minute of the match. The ball comes in and some out. Scores for Gateshead. Just four minutes later, and Croydon responded. Long ball from the keeper all the way over the top. Defenders didn't deal with it, and Badir just poked it home. And then Croydon went in front in the second half. Bizatu calmly slots it home. Their lead didn't last for long. Brilliant ball here from Nonis. But loads still to do here for Sean Neve, who dinks it over the keeper into the far post for a brilliant, brilliant goal to bring the scores level. And that took us through to a full-time score of 2-2. And then Gateshead scores, won it in a very long penalty shootout. First time that Gateshead have been in this final for 11 years and they get their hands on the trophy for a second time. It was a first final for Croydon. In fact, the first time any age group team from the Croydon district have made a final for 40 years and they did themselves proud. Brilliant run through to this final. 
having lost in extra time of the semi-finals last year. I'm sure they'll be back. I think we're just about ready for the presentation. OK, ladies and gentlemen, we'll now make the presentation of the medals and trophy on the pitch. We have Mark Hignett, who is the Vice Chairman of the English Schools Football Association, and Andrea Chilton, who is the Chief Executive of the English Schools Football Association, on hand to do so. First of all, we'd like to say thank you to today's set of match officials for supporting today's final. So if we can put our hands together and show our appreciation for the referee, Nathan Bartram. Yeah. Assistant referees, Andy Smith and Matt Newbold. And the fourth official, Mark Warren. Before we call the players up to receive their commemorative medals, uh, first of all, we have a presentation to make for the player of the match. And the player of the match has been voted for by the viewers on ESFA TV this afternoon. And the viewers have voted for Croydon number 10, Rizka Badia. Commiserations to Croydon Schools FA. They contributed to a fantastic spectacle this afternoon. You should be very pleased with your performance today. So please come forward and collect your medals and let's show them our appreciation putting our hands together for the boys from Croydon as they come forward to collect their medals. Now moving on to today's winners and national champions, Gateshead Schools FA. Fantastic game today, boys. Come forward and collect your medals. Well done. And the captain of Gateshead Schools FA, number eight, Anthony Manda, will collect the trophy on behalf of Gateshead to crown them champions of England for 2020. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. How do you think you're coming in?